what the US visa looks like and then what does it mean? How should we read it when we're looking at the visa stamp on your passport? I could kind of try to, I got a copy of a visa page in front of me sample, which I will try to tell you the reading or understanding of this visa page. First of all, you need to check your passport number if it's correct or not. So you got a visa actually stamp on your passport. First thing you want to make sure that the passport number is correct or not because that's going to be important for you to be uh, able to use you know the you know correct information secondly you want to make sure and check that that your name is spelled correctly so that will be important also so that you don't want to have any problem when you're entering the united states and or at the entry that this is not your name or the misspell this and what's on your visa will be telling the name of the city that where you apply for visa right so let's say if you are um uh, issuing post name is says tokyo and then, then you will be that is actually you apply for visa in tokyo japan right so that's basically shows where your visa was issued actually and another thing you want to make, make sure that you know you have to check the, your date of birth to make sure that if it's correct and that will be very important and that's why you want to check the birth date place on your visa page just to make sure your date of birth is correct on your visa page right on your passport r means regular passport because you'll see it says visa type right on your visa page and if it says r that means it's a regular passport class is the type or visa that you're getting so that means if you're getting a b1 b2 visa the class will be b1 b2 visa type will be r that will mean actual regular passport so that's why the class of visa actually uh, will show that why you're traveling to us what is the purpose of your travel to united states and if you look at the, your you know visa page you will see expiration date and expiration date is the last day you can use your visa to seek entry into the united states it has nothing to do with how long you may stay in the us but that will show you know actually that how long you have time to travel with that visa to the united states Another part is important on your visa page, which is in under you know, section says annotation. So annotation may include additional information about your visa. For example, on a student visa, it will show your service number and name of your correct school. So that's what annotation is about. Don't get you know, nervous. Oh, why did they write my school name and why do they have this number here? So that's actually additional information which they put it there. On your visa page, M means that you can seek entry to the United States multiple times. If there is a number here, you may apply for entry that many times. And that will be is actually under the section of passport number and we'll call entry. So if it says M, that means you can travel to the United States multiple times. So I hope that this little illustration will help reading and understanding of your visa stamp that you get on your passport and if you have any questions feel free to let us know